Warm welcome, this is Markus Termin, Astrologisches Stundenbuch at the 10th of July 2024. The moon is in the sign of Virgo and the sun is still in the sign of Cancer. That makes a sextile position and it's not negative, it's a positive thing to have the sextile in between moon and sun. As I pronounced out yesterday, the moon in Virgo is always the busy helper of the sun in Cancer, tries to provide the sun in Cancer with practical arguments, um, how it could be the best solution to follow the own inner emotions as the Cancer sun um, intends to do actually. This is the basic situation. Of course, up there in Taurus, you see Mars is approaching Uranus um, and it's getting closer and closer. And this is the 15th, all the astrologers talk about, because this is the fixed star of Argol where they meet. And this is a date we have to take care for. Now, if you are born at, in the third decade of Taurus, for instance, which is after uh, the 10th of May, you know, this is the situation, um, then, then um, you are being um, challenged by this Mars and Uranus position. And the same is for Scorpio-born persons, which are actually uh, born at the 10th of um, November, after the 10th of November. And uh, throughout the zodiac, uh, with the, the the fixed signs, you know, um, for for the Aquarius people, it's the tenth of um, how do we put it, February, right? And um, for the for the um, Leo people, it's the tenth from the tenth on of um, August. You know, this is this is the time that we're talking about, and because for Leo people, it's a square position. For Aquarius people, this is going to be in a square position. Um, for Scorpio people, it's in an opposition. And of course, the Taurus folks are hit the most. And what is the right recipe to, to um, face this situation? Um, the, the combination of Mars and Uranus is aggressive, explosive and it's a problematic issue about what do I own and what do the others have. So don't get in fights about that. Just step back, relax if you are able to it. This is the advice any astrologer would give. Uh, that's about um, the overview for today. So basically, moon and sun sextile, um, the first um, little piece of the moon um, is to be seen in the sky. It's the, the month is just starting, you know, with um, with the intensive um, impressions of um, what we get from pictures from there and there. Um, and and it has a big tension already, as you can feel. So take care, folks. Thank you for listening. In case you like to get in contact with the astrologer who can tell you where does that hit me in my chart, how do I prepare for aspects like that, just use this mail address up here and down here at my blog site. You'll find the conditions for a consultation. This is Markus Termin, the 10th of July 2024.